if uh, the third question is if i if ever i see krishna how will i know i am seeing the supreme lord so we understand the supreme lord by the scriptures everything in life when we come across it has to be there is be, the coordination or there should be samanjas between uh, scriptures sadhu and shastra uh, so scripture is shastra sadhu and then also guru so these three things should be uh, coincided or should be consulted and so krishna has certain signs if we see krishna then there are certain marks on the hand marks on the feet when krishna was walking in in vrindavan and akrur came he saw uh, so different marks uh, like uh, ankush and uh, fish and fan and uh, umbrella so there are various signs in his left and right side and the arms and hands his arms are long and uh, the most beautiful person person in the in the whole universe that you will get attracted to so if one sees this symptoms and also by the activity and also by his words uh, like kawa koel dono kale how you will differentiate between a black uh, crow and also a black uh, black uh, uh koel uh, but so the difference is when they speak when they speak the words krishna's words would be deep sounding completely different completely spiritual nothing material and a materialistic person would have a different different topics of talk so that is one way by talking another way by his activity krishna can lift the whole gordan his activity would be uncommon so if you see that some activity it's not a magical activity not something uh, some magician that show but it would be a magician cannot do by seeing him anybody would be spiritualized himself he will always he speak the truth he will be become bent or surrender to the personality of god and so any time if uh, one you sees there is a complete differentiation uh, between a human being and krishna himself and and those can be recognized by sadhu shastra and guru hari krishna